What's going on? I get the email. My name is Monica Marquez, aka Momo from Momo on the Move. Check out my podcast on all listening platforms and visually through YouTube. My podcast is all about exactly what it sounds like being on the move. What's going on, people? Welcome back to Momo on the Move. Today's special guest, we have Thor, my boyfriend. Today, we're going to be talking about stocks. I know um, it's a very scary word. I was scared when I first started investing like a week and a half ago. Um, so we're talking about the stock market because it recently crashed because of this coronavirus and this pandemic and all of these businesses are suffering. So... I brought on Thor because he's taught me a little bit of what I know um, about the stocks and he's going to tell us why sh we should invest now and how we should go about it. So Thor, why should we invest now? Perfect. Let's keep this video very brief. Um, why should we invest now? We should invest now because the stocks are on sale. What does that mean? That means that the stocks right now are being sold for a fraction of the price that they're normally they're normally worth. Mm -hmm. So if a stock if a stock is normally like fifty dollars, the stock right now is like twenty five dollars. It's like half off right now. Every time the stock market crash, all these stocks are worth a whole lot less. So a smart buyer buys these things while they're cheap, sells them low. That is your game plan. Sells them high. Sells them high. I'm sorry. That is your game plan. You want to buy low, sell high. Literally, just like anybody. And how often does the stock market crash? It crashes every 10 years. So somebody like myself was prepared for this. Um, so everybody's in a panic. You know, people have been losing money on the stock market. And, you know, everybody's going crazy. I was preparing myself for this. I was saving cash on the side so that I can invest. Now that the companies are on sale. And that's exactly what I've been doing. I've been making money. You've only been doing this for a week and a half. I've been helping you out. How long? How much did you start with? I put in four hundred dollars, and I just checked my Robinhood, which is one of the platforms that I'm using, and I ha I'm up to six hundred. So I made two hundred dollars doing nothing, which was great. In a week. In a week, people are not working. People are laid off. You're, I'm laid off. <laughs> you're making two hundred dollars, and not even just two hundred dollars. You made whatever you put in, and you got half the money back. So think about it. Whatever you put in in a week, she got half of the money back. That doesn't always happen. That only happens during a stock market crash. So if you know what you're doing, you're going to make a lot of money back. Um, how do you How do we start? Best? Perfect. How do we start? You need to get a platform. You need to have an app. You need to go with a platform. The platform that I recommend is Robinhood. Why? Because Robin, Robinhood doesn't charge you a fee to, to trade or to invest. You know, a lot of platforms charge you a fee. Uh, where whatever bank you use, if you go with them, they're gonna charge you a fee. The only way you don't, you know, you really use that fee is if you have millions of dollars in that account. We're talking about people that are just starting, starting 101. I recommend Robinhood. If you actually want a link that's gonna give you a free stock, the link is gonna appear right here. I love doing that. The link is gonna appear right there. And um, if you actually click that link when you start your account, you actually already started with a free account. So I was given a link, I'm giving you now the, the same link. And uh, before you start, you're already making money because you already have a stock. That stock could be an Apple stock, that stock could be anything, that stock could be worth whatever. You, you just get a random stock and you can sell that right away and make, your and make some money without even doing anything. Um, and you're already twenty, thirty dollars richer, or you can just hold that on and 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 sell it a couple years later, and you'll even make more money. But with that link that I just provided for you, you are ready to go. Download that app and start investing. Uh, question. I know a lot of people like myself. I've always wanted to invest. I never knew what when the right time was. How much money I should invest as a beginner, and. Um, yeah, so do you want to like give a little insight on that? Invest what you feel comfortable with. But what is like a So you started suggested. with 400. You started with 400. Whatever you feel comfortable with. If you want to start with $100, start with $100. When I started, I started with like 2,000 or 3,000, right? But start with whatever you feel comfortable with. Start with $100. Start with $100, start with whatever, $50. Whatever you want to invest, you start with 
Start with a hundred dollars. That's 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 what I'm trying to get at. Okay, start with a hundred dollars. Like, what if I only got ten you know? dollars? Yeah, you can even start with that, but it's just you're you're limited to what you can buy. With a hundred dollars, you can buy a couple shares of different things, and um, and then you can start making money. Now, there's just one quick strategy that I'm just gonna let you guys know about, and this is just to start. This is just to start. We're not gonna go into into deep diving and formulas, and everything. The strategy, like I said before, was buy low or sell high. So look at any company you want. Look at any company you want. You know, one of my favorite companies is Tesla. I'm not telling you to buy that because um, I don't know when you're gonna see this video. But one of my favorite companies is Tesla. So if we look at a Tesla stock, right? At the beginning of the year in January, it was $400 in January. In February, if we look it up in February, February 4th, it was 887. So in one month, it doubled, right? And it goes up and down and that was before the, the, the market crashed. So the market crashed and now that Tesla stock, you know, went down to $361. It's gonna go back up. If you don't have the $361, then don't buy Tesla, buy another stock. But the same principle applies. And that is that whatever stock you buy now that's cheap, in a couple of months when the coronavirus epidemic is over, pandemic, pandemic is over, your, your, your stocks that you bought are gonna go back up. So let's say you use $100 and you buy a, a couple of stocks, that hundred could go turn into 200, 300, a thousand dollars, depending on how much you're holding on to for. But what I just recommend is look at a stock that you know is still gonna be there, a stock like Apple. Um, and there's other stocks, I'm not gonna really tell you what to buy, but I'm just trying to tell you kind of the mindset. The mindset is you look at how the stock has been for the past year, right? Or even the past six months before the stock market crash. You look at that, if you see that it dropped 30%, 40% because of this, pandemic that happened in February, you know that it's gonna go back up. I'm telling you it's gonna go back up because if you look at the trend of how the stock market was over the last 40 years, the stock market just always goes up. Whenever it drops, it just goes back up a couple months later. It literally is only down for a couple of months. So get whatever stock you're interested in buying. If, if you really want a recommendation, I can't tell you really what to buy specifically because I don't know when you're gonna re see this video and I don't wanna set you up for failure. But if you're looking at this now, and right now we're at the end of March. If you're looking at this now, airline companies are down right now because of the coronavirus. So that's, that stock went down 50%, even more than 50%. If you buy airline companies, those are gonna shoot back up. I guarantee you those are gonna shoot back up because people are not flying right now. So so, so no, one's, no one's taking it. So all these companies are losing money. But if you invest in airline companies in a couple of months when everybody's flying and the, and the, and the prices are the same, right now everything's cheap. You saw those they memes? Everybody gonna be flying too. You saw those memes? Oh, yeah, let's have breakfast in Miami. Like everything is cheap right now. But if you, in a couple of months, everything's gonna be expensive. But if you buy now, JetBlue, Delta, American Airlines, I'm just throwing out airline companies. You just throw some airline companies out there, hold it for a couple of months, I'm telling you, you're making your money back right away. Okay, okay. I don't want to really like go too much in. I just kind of wanted to give the game plan and. I think that was a solid intro. And if you'd like more information on the stock market, comment below and we'll make another video. Um, Cause we ain't got nothing else to do during this quarantine. I'm working. Well, I'm not, so he's here with me. Um, also disclaimer, I am no expert in the investing game yet. I am not a stockbroker and I'm not gonna pay for this, but we just thought it'd be a good time to share this little stock market knowledge for you guys since it's like a great time to start putting your money in there. She says she's not an expert, but she already made half of her money back in a week. So she's doing way better than the experts are doing. Just follow the trends, follow the trends. And um, thank you for having me and I, I really appreciate it. Happy investing and good luck. Cheers. If you like what you saw, follow us on all social media platforms. For more Oye Dimelo, click over here. And for more Momo on the move, click right here. Peace.